Greetings and welcome to today's lesson. In today's lesson, we are going to begin by reviewing our phonograms. You should be in your Spalding book and you should be in the front section on page 20. Let's go ahead and begin by um, practicing our phonograms. The first time we go through, we will only say the sound. Okay? I'll give a brief um, chance for you to say the sound and then I'll say it so you can see if you got it right or not. Here we go. Ow, o, u, a. G. R. S. Z. Ed, d, t. R. Oi. Sh. A. Er, ol, a e i, a, sh, ha, wa, da. All right, this time through, you'll say it. <clears throat> you'll say the sound, and if there's a Q, you'll say the Q after it. And then there's a rule that goes with it. Make sure you have that in your head so when I ask it, you already have it there and you can see if you get it right. Da. Wa. Ha. Sh. When can I use it? Beginning of the word, end of the word, or the beginning of the syllable ship. Ah, not used. A E I O Er early A Sh tall right and this will be the one we primarily use when we can't use S H Oi not used R Ed D T. When can I use it? You can use it for past tense. S Z. R. Two letters. G. Ow, O, U, A. All right. Next, we are going to um, write them in our books. Let me shuffle these up. Again, we're on page 20. Let's shift all the way over to the left. We'll use this column right here. I'm going to do it in manuscript for grades first and second, and in cursive for third through fifth. All right, here we go. First one. Okay, go ahead and write it. And then look up to see if you get it right. Next one. Mm. Two letters. Mm. Two letters. Next one. Ow, o, u, a. Ow, o, u, a. Next one, oi, not used, oi, not used. Next one, ah, not used, ah, not used. Next one, sh, tall, sh, tall. Next one, A, A. Next one, D, D. Next one, Er, Er. 
early, er, early. Next one, all, all. Next one, shh, shh. Next one, wa, wa. Next one, s, z, s, z. Next one, ed, da, t, ed, da, t. Next one, a, e, e, a, e, e. Next one, g, g. Last one, wrong, wrong. All right. Now, if you missed any of those, just put a line through it and put it out, um, write it correctly out to the side so you know which ones to spend extra time studying on. All right, that's the end of this uh, video. You'll continue with your words in the next one. I hope you have a great day. I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye.